I like to start off talks on patient safety with four facts. And I've got them written down here in case I pull a Rick Perry and can only remember three. <laughs> <laughs> the first is that medical injury is pervasive and substantial and in every possible venue, uh, all types of health care, all sites, committed by all kinds of professionals and with all types of treatment. Uh, the second is that accountability in healthcare is weak to non-existent at every level, national, state, local, and within hospitals. <coughs> Government agencies lack the resources and usually the power or the inclination to identify hazards, to do anything about them, or to enforce safety rules in hospitals or other places. The third is that the unique structure of healthcare and the way we finance it not only does not provide incentives for safety, it provides serious disincentives for safety. And the third is that physicians who we would fourth, the physicians who we would think would be leading the movement have in general, in the majority, been distinguished by their passivity. <laughs> 